Hey everybody, it's Tammy, the Pink Survivor. Welcome to day three of your summer Kickstarter, or Kickstart. Okay, so today all you're gonna need is, if you have a mat or somewhere comfortable that you can get down on the floor, we'll do a few exercises there today. And also, if you have a light pair of weights or any pair of weights, great. If not, you can still do this entire workout, no problem. So today we're gonna be doing a lower body super set workout. You'll kind of get the idea once we get into it, but for now, let's start warming up, okay? So I just want to kind of stand a little wide with our feet here, and then you're just going to kind of come down and come back up. So we're kind of warming up our lower body today because that's going to be our focus. Everything kind of, you know, from the waist down, we're going to be doing some different exercises. So with this one, we're going to only be doing about maybe eight to 10 reps of every exercise. Let's come down and hold here. You can even go a little wider with your feet if you want to and you kind of just rock side to side, okay? So we're gonna do every exercise, like I said, eight to 10 you know, reps of each exercise. And then we're gonna move on. So we're gonna do two different exercises and then we're gonna repeat them three times. So like I said, you'll get the idea. Okay, let's do a few little front kicks. So you're just gonna kick out and then switch. Kick and kick. So this kind of warms up our hamstring a little bit too. You'll feel that. So this is kick. If you wanna put your arm into the movement, go ahead. If not, you just have it right on your waist. It's up to you. I hope you guys are feeling great. This is day three. Remember, stay focused. Commit to yourself. You're gonna eat healthy. You're gonna keep moving. You're gonna do this workout. You're gonna do some butt kicks now, so you're just kicking it back. And also, maybe you're gonna add in a little cardio. 20 minutes would be great. You could even do more. Break it up, get those little walks in whenever you can. Okay, so you got a little bit more here. Good. Let's come up on our toes just a little bit. We are gonna be doing some calf raises, but we're just warming up still here. Good. You'll probably want some water, you know, in your towel also as well. And don't forget to like and subscribe. It helps my channel so much. Thank you for being here. Let's take a good deep breath too, okay? So, our first round of exercises for this superset is going to be a front squat, which I am going to grab a weight, so I'm gonna show you. But remember, if you don't have a weight, no problem. You're gonna hold it here in the front. That's why it's called a front squat. Your feet are about shoulder width apart. Then you're gonna come down into your squat. You're sitting back. Your knees don't come in like this. I really want you to think about that. They kind of stay pretty straight or even a little out, okay? Just hold away here. If not, no way. You're still doing the same exact thing. Okay, so we got this here. Good. And we're gonna do two more. And down. Okay, the next one you're gonna do is, I'm gonna grab both weights, if you have, and it's going to be a calf raise. So we're gonna just come up on your toes and down. Okay, keep going, up on those toes and down. We can do a little more of these. That's 15, back to the front squat. So let me just put this down, here it is. Good deep breath, ready? Let's do 10 of these. We're squatting down, coming back up, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Let me go as low as you can go. Okay, back to our 15 calf raises. So you're here, remember, just kind of up on your toe. One, two, three, four, five. Five more. OK, 
Okay, that was two rounds. So we have one more round of that. Grab that weight again if you have. It's in the front here. Feet shoulder width apart, remember? And down into your squat. Watch your knees, remember? Don't hold your breath. That's five. Six. Seven. The weight is in your heels. Eight. Nine. And you're sitting back. One more. And ten. Back into our calf raises. Then we'll take a little break. One, two. Got 15 of these. Three, four, five. Two more. And good. So that was your first round of your superset. We did our front squats and we did our calf raises. Have some water. Just keep marching or walking, whatever you want to do. I hope you guys are feeling good. Sometimes by the time you get to the third day, you might be feeling a little tired and I don't want to keep doing this, but just keep going. Because remember, you're committed to these seven days, okay? So this is day three. Okay, what we're going to do this time is we're going to do a front uh, lunge. Okay, I'm gonna just take maybe the one weight just to show you some options. So what we're going to do is we're gonna step out with our left foot. You're gonna step out, then you're gonna come down and then push up. Okay, so we're stepping down. We're only gonna do 10 on each side. Good. Four. Five. This is just adding a little extra challenge. Six. Step down. Push off. Two more. Good. Step down. Push off. Okay, switch sides. This time we're gonna step forward with your right foot first. Step forward, you come down, you push off that front leg. It's two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, nine, and ten. Okay, the next exercise you're going to do is we're going to do holding a weight here if you have, and you're going to just be lifting up your, your knee and back down. See that? We just come up, these little like knee lifts. And if not, just do it with no weight. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Go ahead and switch to the other side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, back to our uh, lunges. Okay, so remember, if you want, wait here. If not, no problem. Left foot, push off. If you have knee pain, don't go as far. Just make them little minis, okay? Good. Seven. Eight. Nine and ten. Remember, this is our round two of the superset. Right foot. Ready? One and two, three, four, five. Six, 
seven, eight, hope you're still with me, nine, and 10. With or without a weight, kind of just resting here. Hold on to something if you need to, and you're doing this knee up and down. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch, and this will be the end of round two. So then we just have one more of those. Stick with me. Eight, nine. Oh, let's get this last round of, oh, I almost grabbed that, of a front stepping lunges done. Ready? Left foot. Good. That's five. Of you guys. This is not easy. Switching sides to the right. If you only get eight reps in, that's perfectly fine. Oops, almost fell on that one. <laughs> Gotta think about it. Working your balance here. That's five. Oh, this is our last round of these, thank goodness. Seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, let's do that last round of those knee ups. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Switch sides, and then we get a little break. Have some water. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, let me put my weight back here. I'm getting a little sweaty now. That lower body seems to really gets you sweating a lot quicker. So during this break, I am gonna put my mat out. And we're gonna do something on the ground. Okay. So if you have this, if not, we're just gonna be on the carpet or wherever you have. Just put my uh, mat out here so I can show you guys. Okay, so we're gonna come down here, laying on your side, and we're gonna do a leg abduction. Okay, and if you want to, you could have a weight right here. So maybe I'll just grab a, a little light weight just to kind of show you guys. Okay, so 10 on each side, okay, is what we're gonna start with. So we just come up and back down. Okay, so 10 of these. And that's 10. Go ahead and switch sides up. You can just go ahead and roll over if you want to. But I'm gonna go ahead and switch sides. Also with these, like my toes not pointed up, I try and point it either down or just forward. Okay, so that way it's working more the outside of the leg. That's five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Pretty easy to guess what we're gonna do next, but it's gonna be the inside of the leg and adduction. So you can stay right where you're at. You can place that weight if you want. I like to have my back leg bent a bit and then the front leg straight and then it comes up. So it's working the inside of the leg. Adductions, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. Switch it over. Let's do the same thing. You can also have your uh, back leg in front like this if you like, it's up to you. Whatever feels more comfortable. Okay, one, two, three, 
four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so that was the first round. So we do have, you know, two more rounds of that. Okay, let's go back to the side. So, and then after this, we're going to be done. So don't give up now. Okay, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six. If this is too easy, by the way, go ahead and bring that leg forward. Whew. You're going to feel a difference. Okay, switch it right over. So it's up to you. That leg can be here or here. Let's get 10, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Let's get the inside of that leg. Go ahead and rest that weight here if you want to. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I'm going to switch it over. This is going to complete round two. Now we just have one more. Now we're done. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Well, I want to get this over with, so I'm going to go ahead and get started on the last round of leg abductions. Ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Switch it over. Whew. Start here if you want. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So close. We just have the inside of the leg on both sides, so let's get it done. Proud of you guys for sticking with me today. Good. Switch it over. Ten more. This is it. This is the last exercise. One, two, three, four, five. And ten. Oh, I certainly hope you guys made it through that entire workout. I'm really, really proud of you guys. We're just going to do a minute or two of stretching. Um, Tammy is really sweating. The lower body is kind of hot in here. But let's uh, just stretch it out just a little bit, okay? On your knees, you can have one leg out like this, and then you're just going to try and bend it over. <sighs> Slowing it down now. Anytime we work the lower body, they're much bigger muscles, so you do uh, get tired a little quicker. Your heart rate can go up a little more. You'll burn a little more calories too, though. And uh, you'll probably sweat a little more. Stretch this side. And good. Okay, how about sitting on your mat or floor and doing the best just to kind of reach down, down your leg toward your toes, okay? Do the best you can. We are gonna feel it in the back of your legs. Good job, okay? Laying on your side, and then you'll just grab that top ankle or foot, and then you're just kind of pulling it back. Now we're stretching the front of the leg. You can keep on stretching after this is over. If you want to keep stretching your lower body a little bit, go ahead and switch sides. And remember, get a little extra walking in. You can do your walks before the workout. You can do your walks after. You can do the walks. Um, if you work out in the morning, you could do your walks after dinner, whatever works for you. Or break them up and do 10 minutes after lunch and 10 minutes after dinner. Just whatever works. As long as you get it done, you still got it done. Okay, sitting up here, you can put your heels together. You can do a little butterfly stretch, kind of stretch the inside of your legs. Take a good deep breath here. I'm so proud of you guys. 
You are done with day three and I will see you tomorrow. Have a great day. Focus, eat healthy, keep moving. Bye.